Hi, this is Raquel with Balloon Art Clip Art. I have a tutorial here on Publisher 2019, I think it is, for the uh, new uh, Quick Access Toolbar. The Quick Access Toolbar is this little specialized toolbar down here. Everyone is going, each person's is going to look a little bit different because you customize it the way you want. I feature it in a number of my videos. I think the last time I did a Quick Access Toolbar uh, tutorial, it was for a previous version of Publisher. So to access this toolbar, you go to File, and you go to Options, and there you can take a look at the Quick Access Toolbar. Uh, make sure that you have the little check here, Show Quick Access Toolbar below the ribbon, so it shows up where you see mine. And then the other thing that I do is I show all commands. That way I can see everything that uh, is available to be put on the Quick Access Toolbar. This is what I currently have on mine. I have the Save and the Save As, because oftentimes I will do a Save As, a PDF, or a PNG file, or I will change the name of a publisher file. I also have the Shape Fill and uh, the Picture Border Color, Outline Weight, Shadow, Picture Fill, Shapes, Crop Picture, Group and Ungroup, Page Parts, that is the library of the building blocks that um, I oftentimes will click on and it, that list will pop up of a whole bunch of um, different clip art that I've created. Um, here's another uh, tool here for showing the building block library. Uh, font Color, this is if you want to tighten up the spacing. Anyway, uh, Set Transparent Color, that's an important one there and then just some of your layering tools. There may be other tools that you want um, in your quick access toolbar. As you become adept with Publisher, there may be certain things that you want to do for uh, specific types of customizations and things to, to give it your own look. So anyway, that's where you can find it. If you want to change the order of anything here, you can just select on it and then you click up and down and it will change the order of these if you want them in a certain uh, in a certain order. So that's kind of the tour there. Once you get all the, the quick access toolbar icons in there, you just hit OK and it will update this toolbar right here. Um, the uh, the button I was talking about for the clip art, that's what that icon looks like. And then you can see, you know, I obviously have the complete set of clip art. This is the other one that I had on there where it shows it. Let me shrink this window down a little bit here. It shows it in a different format. Kind of zoom it in so you can see everything. So if you wanted to look at, you know, just the page parts. Oh, I just I clicked it twice. Let's try that again here. We can go here and we can go to, this is opening up really big, I don't know why that is, but we can go to page parts and for example these are all the files that I have created over time. If this is an easier way for you to look for the clip art that you want then you can just click on it, actually I think you double click on it then it inserts it in there. So two different ways to access your clip art, whichever one is better for you. So anyway, that is a tour of the quick access toolbar. So when you hear me talk about it or you see me reaching up here to click on specific things, that is how I customize it. This is Raquel Porter with Balloon Art Clip Art.